What's up everybody? My name is Peter Perez. I'm a coach with Built Brigade and today I'm going to show you a little bit about the deadlift. Uh, a lot of the time I notice people end up getting a little bit mixed up, especially the first few people that end up working out. As soon as someone teaches them a deadlift, they're over here just grabbing the bar, fucking yanking it and starting to go. Then they end up with cat back or shitting their spine out. So I just want to give you a little bit, <laughs> I just want to give you a little bit more of a, uh, like a general idea of how to approach it. I'm talking only conventional today though. Uh, that's generally what I pull. I don't pull sumo, so I'm not really much help in that realm, but trust me, trust me, I will get someone, if not myself, I'll get someone else to totally help you guys out with that. So first things first, when it comes to a deadlift, generally how I approach it is I want someone to set their feet up first, okay? Uh, a lot of people will just start going. They're not even lined up to the bar. One side's longer than the other. You wanna avoid that as much as possible. So what I want you to think about is uh, this is more of an athletic approach, but I feel like it's fairly universal for the most part. What I recommend to people is line up where you feel like your feet are most comfortable. Give me a jump, real light jump, and generally where you land is going to be a solid spot for you to go ahead and pull from. So if I'm setting up, everything's good here. The first thing I want to think about is I'm not going to get into bracing or anything like that. I just want to focus now on being able to get a solid executed position to be able to go through with the whole lift. So... I want the, the person to think of a slight bend in that knee from here, hinge backwards. So I want you to think about pushing your hips back as far as you can and let your arms hang until you realize you're getting a little bit close to the bar. And then from there, you bend the knees a little bit more. Do me a favor, stand over here, bro. So from there, what I want that person to think of, I want that rear delt, uh, like scap top of the scapula to be lined up with the bar to be able to efficiently pull. So I'm here, back into position. Everything's looking good. I'm leaning forward just slightly, just so I can kind of shift my weight backwards. So you want to be able to wedge that bar off the ground, okay? So from here, I'm leaning over it. I'm gonna shift back into my hips. Now my glutes, hamstrings, and everything's engaged. I want to think about getting my shoulders and my hips to rise completely at the same time. So I don't want any of this, and then pulling, and then my shoulders, all that stuff, you wanna avoid that as much as you can. So from here, like I mentioned before, hips and shoulders rise at the same time. I want you to think about pushing down into the ground as much as you can, and extending at the hip. Right back down, straight leg deadlift, and as soon as you get past that knee, bend at the knee. Right from here again, wedge backward into the weight, leg press, hips rise at the same time, Another thing I want you guys to keep in mind is keeping that bar as close to your body as you can. The further it gets away from you, the more that hip is going to rise. And now, from that point, my quads aren't engaged in the movement at all. My hips, my uh, hamstrings are gonna be doing most of the work, and now my lower back is too, because it creates a longer lever arm, and you're not gonna be able to lift that way without shitting out your spine like I mentioned before. It's getting really fucking hot in here, I'm not gonna <laughs> lie to you guys. <laughs> But that's the general setup. So I'm going to take you guys through it one more time, one more good time before I shut this shit off and, and go lay down or something. So like I said, feet lined up, slight bend in the knee, hips go back. As soon as you notice you start getting close to the bar, connect. From here, shift the body weight backward into your butt, glutes, hips, getting those lats locked in, leg press into the ground, hips rise at the same time. Extend at the hip. And that's it. I'm gonna go lay down somewhere because this shit is fine. 